Did you know that you can use your Nano VNA as a crude band scope? Here's how I did it. I apply RF to the channel 1 position. Then I set the frequency limits. It can't be a very wide band, but the display you see here is of part of the AM broadcast band. From 700 kHz to 1400 kHz. You can see the relative strength of the various stations. So that your screen is uncluttered, you need to remove some of the traces from the display. In this case, I've removed trace 2 and 3. You can do that under the Trace tab. A big trade-off is because the thing doesn't sweep very fast, you can get a better display by zooming in. To do that, you have a smaller frequency range. Here in Melbourne, we have a station on 774 kHz. I will change the range, so we'll have a start of, let's say, 750. And we will stop it at, let's say, 790. That's interesting, there's two peaks. This is 774, which is the station's carrier frequency. And we'll just go down. And this is 763, which is the other peak. I'm not sure how exact the frequency of this is. Maybe it's a few kilohertz off. This is 160 meters. 1.81 to 1.85. And you'll see there's a small peak around 1825. I'll disconnect the antenna. I'll connect in the FT817. And we'll see what sort of signal is audible there. And there is indeed AM activity there. Next we'll try the FM broadcast band. Not seeing much on the FM broadcast band, I've selected 88 to 108. So instead, I'll try a narrower range, maybe just around one or two stations. This time it's working. The peak you see on the far left is 105.1. If we move it along, there's another one, 105.9. And there's a smaller peak down at the end, 107.5. So that coincides with local FM broadcast stations. And I should mention I'm just using the G5RV on that with lots of coax, so it won't be much good as a receiving antenna. I'll just narrow the tuning range a little bit more so that it's only covering one station. Well, it's actually covering two stations. I put in 105 to 106. We'll zoom in a bit more. This is 105 to 105.2. And there's a bit more. It's the middle of the day, but we'll try another amateur band. This time, 7 megahertz. This is 7 to 7.150. And... It is in the middle of the day, and I'm not getting anything to appear on the screen. Now I'll just transmit a local signal. Oh, oh, and 
you can see there's a movement. This is 145650. There's a CW beacon there. Just apply a local signal. Just connected an antenna for two meters and still not seeing anything. So that's a quick little experiment. If you don't have any other gear that has a spectrum display, then you can use your nano VNA to do it in a crude fashion. Here's another experiment. If you have a germanium diode and some high impedance headphones, try connecting them to channel zero with the diode in series with the headphones. If you set the frequency to an AM broadcast frequency, you may be able to hear audio. I did try that, results weren't great, but I was able to hear some of the stronger stations.